It's been a painful start to the new year for one Murray County mother. She says someone stole her late son's ashes at a bus station. News Channel 5's Matthew Torres tells us she's not angry. She just wants them back. He was life lighted to Vanderbilt and his heart stopped at 7.33 p.m. In the helicopter. It's been more than two years since Ryan Johnson died from a motorcycle crash in Spring Hill. Ryan's mother, Jerry, has an urn of his ashes to keep his memory alive. And this world is not a good place without him. He brightened it up. This is what he did. His ashes were split among his family. But on New Year's Eve, the unthinkable. He went back and it was gone. Jerry's other son took a Greyhound bus from Indiana to Nashville. He got off but quickly realized he left the bag with his brother's ashes and boots. He checked back but it was nowhere to be found. I feel like somebody took that bag because they saw the boots. They saw they were good boots and I think they took it. It's been devastating for Jerry who doesn't want her face shown. She says it could be anyone's child whose ashes are lost. You got to pray about it. I don't want to be mad and I don't want to be bitter, but you just have to pray about it. It's been equally difficult for the brother who feels guilty. She just hopes the person who took the ashes realizes what it took away from her family. Whoever took it, keep the boots. I don't care about the boots. I just want my baby to come home. Matthew Torres, News Channel 5. Jerry pleads for someone to drop off the ashes at the bus station. An official with Greyhound was not able to comment.